Good morning and welcome to a brand new vlog. And today it is 7.30 a.m. and we need to get some quick breakfast and take a golf cart to the exit of the hotel, hop in the bus and go somewhere cool. And hopefully not get eaten by the sharks. So wish us luck. If you still have not subscribed to the channel or liked the video, I'd like to tell you, please do that because where else would you see daily life of a Russian guy doing stuff. Only macaroni. There's a bird screaming like heck. What's going on there? A lot of people wake up just at 7.30 so that they can have breakfast and lay on the beach for God knows how long. So we had a very, very quick breakfast and now we need to go catch a golf cart to uh, get to the exit of the hotel. Oh, we found the golf cart. I have no idea what the guy is saying, but uh, we're rushing to go over to the exit, but uh, we're taking a bigger lap. No idea how that works. Here we are, going on the trip. Shukrat. Oh, this is a flipping nice bus if you ask me. I gotta tell you for a fact that tourist buses are way better than in Turkey. Like, because uh, remember when we went like quad biking and stuff like that? They were dirty inside and stuff like this. This is a very nice air conditioned bus and it smells very good. Well, we have arrived to the port. Now we need to find Evelina's mother somehow. We have no idea how. So we came over to this boating place and now we're waiting for them to uh, board us on. We know that our boat is called Omar 4. Very nice. Hopefully Omar 4 doesn't sink and let us feed the fishes because that is not on my plan today. But we are gonna go to this very nice looking little sand island. We're also gonna do a bit of scuba diving. You guys are gonna check it out. Should be pretty awesome. I hope anyways. It's like an eight hour trip. Could you imagine that? So this is how it looks like, a bunch of people over here. We got called up for our boat Omar 4. Let's go check it out. Holy macaroni, we're in. So we made it over to the yacht. And you could even sunbathe in the front. Look at this. Look at this. No helipad, but you know, whatever, we're in Egypt. So this is uh, how it looks like. I'm going to be driving this thing, so this is where I'm going to be sitting. Driving down there, you know. I gotta tell you one thing guys this omar guy that does the trip is a flipping legend every single other boat in this place is filled to the brim our boat is has some people but it's quite empty on top so we don't have to be like sardines in a can looks like we're leaving right now he's warming up the engines there's a, a lot of fish in the sea check this out look at all the fishes a lot of fishes Look at this boat. Looks like it's gonna sink tomorrow. Not ours. We got a nice looking flipping boat. We're flipping going guys. Look at all the boats. Look at this guys, we're going somewhere. This is a flipping great trip. This is not like in Turkey where they put like tons and tons of people inside. This is actually where you have a few people on the boat and you chill out and enjoy the views that are being cramped in with stupid music. Very flippin' nice. So this guy smoking a cigarette, drinking coffee and talking on the phone. You know when your hands are busy you just gotta use your foot. Bon appetit to whoever's eating right now. Bon appetit. Very nice. Anyways, but uh, it's probably a good captain. Very nice. We're also gonna do a review of the whole boat, but right now, check this out. 
This is how it looks like on the second deck right here. So they're doing an English uh, instruction about English scuba diving. We got a boat right there around the place. Nice looking tables where the captain here is steering with his leg, listening to music. This is how it looks like. So we signed our lives away and uh, they're cooking some food here. We're downstairs on the ship. Some food cooking there. Oh, hello my friend. We could spin this around the place. This is how it looks like on the first floor. Walking around here, checking it out. There's also an engine bay there. This is how it looks like. Oh wow, this is beautiful. We're approaching our first stop right now and look at the amount of boats in this place. The macaroni, look, tons and tons of different boats right here. Everybody is swimming in the middle of the sea. We can be like the pirates, aborting other people's boats. Holy macaroni, I'm burnt or tanned, I don't even know. I look different in the camera now. Look at the amount of boats, it's crazy. All of this place, could you imagine how many boats there are? Absolutely crazy. Well guys, we're gonna go in now. Bringing you with me with this GoPro. Hopefully it doesn't crack even more. Ah, oh, well, if it cracks, it is what it is. <laughs> Too small for children. <laughs>
That was good. Sorry. Ooh, well, that was one heck of a good flipping dive. I really flip and enjoyed it. Now we're gonna go for a second stop, and I think we're gonna be eating a bit of food. Well, I didn't film it, but we crashed into the boat. Whatever. Time to get some food. Hey, smokes! Look at the amount of people, and we got some food. Let's go and eat. Some salads. Somebody ate all the bread. Oh, nice view. Ooh. Get some food. Yes, my friend. More? A bit more. Thank you. Buy a bit more, man. Get more, get more. Yeah. Whoa, look at this. Now I'll be floating. One spoon. Oh, thank you very much. Bread. Oh, chicken only. Look at this. Now we're not gonna die of starvation up in this boat. We'll be walking around the place. <laughs> Where is the goddamn bread? No bread. Bread's finished for you. Yep. I'm on a diet now, I guess. <laughs> yeah, good diet. Food review on the ship. Let's try it out. Try the pasta first. Oh, this is actually not bad. Not flipping bad. You know what? This is really flipping good. Delicious. I recommend this ship to anybody. Omar Four. Best meals on the ship. Oh, guys, this was very flipping good. And we're going down there somewhere. We're arriving to somewhat, it looks like a bunch of penguins in the middle of the sea. But that's people. Look at this. What's going on over there? That's supposed to be an island, but it got flooded. Well, let's flip and go to see the island. No, there's no island. It's underwater. Flip and hey guys, we're swimming. <laughs> After eating a bit of food, we're gonna puke all over this place. Very nice. Well, here we are. The ship has broken. Now we're trying to save our lives. <laughs> <laughs> we're swimming towards an unknown island to survive there. We're standing in the middle of the sea. Holy God. We're in the sea. <laughs> we're saved. <laughs> Look at the amount of people there. Look at this guys, we're in the middle of the sea, standing like this. What the heck is going on? Look at the amount of boats here. Left me, but left me. Oh, this nice sand. Yeah, very nice. Very high quality. You want to buy sand? $5. When are you gonna get this Egyptian sand? Tell me. Tomorrow? Today is good. <laughs> we have made it over to the island. If you do that, then uh, we're gonna be on the news again. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow, look at this. The island, we have made it over. Look at this. Safe weapon, nice. Oh, this actually feels nice. Yeah. I got the fire really on my toes, so I can drag a little uh, rub. Yeah? Like a scrub. Yeah, it's very dirty. Like, yeah, but when you go in, it goes. Like, let me put your... 
just uh, chilling in the middle of the sea, sitting down in the sand. A bunch of people walking around the place. Oh, I'm in the phone from Portals. What is it? Uh -huh. Crazy. No sharks yet. You know what? This is very flippant. Oh. Where are you gonna walk in the middle of this sea when I uh, find the island? I wonder what would happen if there was a shark there. Like we were in the middle of the thing. Now we have to fuck it up. All three of us. Gonna head low. low. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine. I'm gonna head low. I'm gonna keep his eyes out. <laughs> We'll probably lose, but, but still, come on, we have to die fighting. <laughs> well, guys, that was flipping awesome. Now we are on the way back to land. Anyways, nobody got attacked by sharks, which is flipping awesome. And I have no idea how long it'll take us to go back, but I guess I'll be editing yesterday's vlog right now on this ship. Very flipping nice. Look at a view from here, it's amazing. Very flipping nice. We're finally arriving over to the port. Flipping neck, I'm starving. Well, we have arrived back on shore, safe and sound, two hours before dinner, so I can't wait. I'm starving. A lot of swimming done today. Oh, damn, check out this Ford right here. It's very nice. Anyways, we're not taking the Ford, we're taking the Toyota. I wish it was that bus, like the one we took over here, but it's gonna be the newer one completely forgot to tell you this guys it's evelina's mother's birthday today and we're gonna go out to the city somewhere but first we're gonna have a bit of a snack at the hotel because when we came back i fell asleep the internet uploaded the video quite quick which was awesome so we're gonna go have a snack and then go somewhere nice omar has told us a place uh, where we can uh, flip and get something you know but I gotta tell you one thing, Omar did a great flipping tour. He's a flipping legend. So if you're ever in Egypt, go check him out. Feeding some cats. Let's see what we're gonna get for dinner today. We're gonna have a bit of shawarma. What is? Я уже взял. Держи. Держи. So I got myself some flipping nice food. Let's get stuck into it. Okay, hey, very tasty. I tried a little bit of chicken. So I was like, I'll have an extra portion. All of that popcorn. Oh, very nice. Oh, very nice. <laughs> huh? Oh, can I have uh, one? Oh, like this. Seems like today is a whole different day of foods. We're gonna be trying some stuff. Oh, look at this. Egyptian potatoes, Torli. Wow, this looks very good. I'm gonna have some Egyptian potatoes. Heck yes. Getting some of that stuff right now. Not leaving without any Egyptian potatoes. Oh, would you just look at that. That looks nice. Nothing better than some Egyptian potatoes. That guy's still making pasta every single day. For the Italians, they need a bit of pasta, a bit of spaghetti. Holy smokes. Look, they got Egyptian soup. They got a bunch of couscous. We got some Keep taking photos with a bunch of sauce and garlic. Oh, wow. This actually looks very good. Oh, I'm definitely taking this. Egyptian gulag. Mmm, very nice. Let's have a bit of this. 
This looks nice. Since there's a lot of Italian people in this hotel and they probably might not want to taste something new, they get some macaroni in a flipping uh, oven. Look at this. Oh, a bit of pasta. Oven pasta. Oh, mamma mia. But we're going to be having some manly Egyptian food. None of that macaroni. Some manly Egyptian food. Evelina called me up. Oh, some Egyptian dessert. Very nice. Very nice. Well, we thought we we're going to be having a quick snack, but we got a bunch of flipping food. Let's try this out. Let's try out this. Now today, the food is on point. Yesterday, the day before, they were slacking. Let's try out some Egyptian potato. Have you ever guys had Egyptian potato? Mm -hmm. Not bad, but I wish they would have cooked the potato a bit more. The rice is flipping amazing. The potato so-so. Also got some popcorn. I'm like in a flipping cinema right now. This is really good. If somebody is eating right now, bon appetit. Feeding a bit of cats right now. I ate them. We made up friends with a taxi driver and now we go with him all the time. Very flipping nice. Lada, no? Oh, Lada. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> we have made it back to the old city where they sell anything from watches, hats, and sandals. Those sandals. Oh, you remember me? <laughs> this way. Thank you very much, my friend. So right now we're gonna be checking out what's going on here on the streets of Egypt. People eating some food over there, people selling some shirts, and some beautiful lights beside a mosque. Very nice. Evelina really likes those cool looking lamps. I gotta tell you for a fact that Egypt is flipping beautiful. Like, look at this mosque behind me, it's magnificent. I really like the Sharma Sheikh vibes, you know? It is a touristy place, it is a highly secure place. By the way, guys, if you've never been to Sharma Sheikh, you might as well come here. You know, a lot of people are scared for some reason, but this is like a very high class security city. Like, it's under very big control. So, it's flipping nice, you know? You feel safe here, nobody is gonna rob you, nobody is gonna steal you. Feels awesome, so if you've never been here, I highly recommend you to come here, because first of all, it's flipping hot, second of all, because you're gonna get an awesome suntan, third of all, the Red Sea has like the best looking fishes ever, and if you go over diving and stuff like that, or like on a boat like we did today, it is just absolutely flipping awesome. And also you could get yourself some legit, I swear, real bags and stuff like that. I swear, this is 100% real. So we're about to enter a store right here. Look at all this stuff right here. It says, this is all the stuff. Like imagine you could buy this and be walking around saying, this is 100% legit. And it smells like leather here as well. We're coming into another store right now. Check out what they got here. Pyramids and shishas. Oh, wow. Oh, 
Guys, check this out on the market here. They have a huge flip in fish. Look at the size of it. Holy macaroni, that's huge. Wait a minute, that's not a real fish. That's not a real fish. They're lying to us. Very flipping cool. We're gonna be trying out the shrimps. Let's see how it is. That's for one kilogram of shrimp. I don't know if it's good or not, but we're gonna have it. So we made it over to the top. Nearly flipping died from uh, nearly break my toe again. So um, we got a nice view here as well. We got a bunch of stuff. They did a present, some bread. Now if they didn't, I'm gonna fight this guy right here. So look at this, very nice. You get to dip stuff in and we get the view of the mosque. So let's see. Will the Farja or Faresh scam us or not? Hopefully not. We got a bunch of shrimp. Let's try it out. <laughs> Let's try it out. Well, I'm gonna record like this. We got a shrimp. Let's try it out. Oh my God. This is very bad. This is like the worst flipping shrimps I've ever had in my life. I don't even know what the heck, I spat it all out. It tastes very flipping weird. There's something wrong with those shrimps. Well, it's time to speak with the manager in the Farish restaurant in Sharm El Sheikh. I don't know what the heck is wrong. It's supposed to be very flipping good, but it's just horrible, very bad. So the restaurant tried to rip us off. They've added a bunch of stuff we didn't order. I flip and knew it because this is the old time flip and scam where they bring you out a bunch of stuff, add it to the menu. Flip and heck, look at this. So this is what uh, they put in here. We didn't even order this. We ordered the fries. Then they also put the bread. It's called Farish. It is in Sharm El Sheikh. Very good place if you want to get scammed. Very nice. They also bring you ice cream after getting scammed and bombed with the prices that you didn't even order something. Very flipping nice. So this is the name of the place, Farish. You never want to come over here. Only if you want to get ripped off. So very flipping nice. Very, very nice. This is one of the places you don't want to go to. So this is the place. If you want to get screwed over, this is the place to go. Farish seafood, very nice. Guys, you know what? I don't want anybody to get screwed over in Egypt, in that restaurant, once more time. Because they screw over everybody. And you know what I thought? We should fight against tourist traps like that restaurant. So let's, I'm gonna leave a link to Google reviews and every single one of you I would really appreciate it if you could give them a one-star review saying a big big scam so let's do that really appreciate it and you know what you'll save a lot of people's money because elderly people they might just pay and get scammed without even noticing because all of the bill was in Arabic and I saw like it was just random numbers and I was like, what the heck is this? We only ordered like three things after you gave us crappy shrimps that I'm um, probably gonna have explosive diarrhea from that I couldn't even like eat one of them. So come on guys, I'm gonna leave them a review. You leave them a review. Let's show them how the sanctioned Ivan doesn't take any crap from scammers like that place. Now I didn't record when I was screaming my head off at them that they were scamming me. But you know what? I didn't pay them of what they were asking me for. So screw those scammers. Don't ever go to that place. Be safe when you're traveling. So after that rage of sitting in a shop, we called the taxi guy. His name is Mahmoud. He's gonna go pick us up and drive us to the hotel. Flip a nice guy. We give him chocolates because he has like four kids. So it's good. He's gonna give the kids some chocolates. We gave it, we gave it to him on the way here. So flipping nice. What is the taxi? Evelina is there. 
Our friend Mahmoud has came over. My friend, hello. Hello. Whoa. Oh, automatic door. <laughs> I have no idea how this happens, but I'm also naked once more. Anyways, guys, I'm back to the hotel room. You know, the experience of being in that restaurant kind of ruined everything, but it is okay. Hopefully, we will take revenge back on them. So, you know what? To save any future people for going there, let's leave some bad reviews for them, which I'm gonna do myself as well. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed this awesome, huge vlog. And if you did, please press the like button, subscribe and comment in the comment section below on what you would like to see in the vlog. Love every single one of you. Have a great day, great night, great morning, whatever you guys are having. See ya.